Child, did, did you not tell a little child on the pram who was shouting ananas, ananas? Yeah. When we were in the garden. Yeah. And um, yeah, I, the the young ones, uh, you know, it, it, it's hard to for the young one to understand everything about uh, philosophy, the mindsets, and stuff like that. But uh, there's so much value in for an adult to understand what it is because. The young ones are our future. It's that's the next generation, and as much as we put a lot of focus, we should also focus on ourselves to give the best focus to the young ones for that growth. Um, that's why I like to call them BB pineapples, uh, not to laugh at them or whatever. It's just it makes it cute, <laughs> uh, but that's also the reality because you start as a seed, then you grow as a BB pineapple, and if you keep positively feeding yourself, you become a bigger pineapple, a mature pineapple, and you always need to feed yourself, always need to adjust and feed your roots, otherwise it stops there, and you should never plateau, right? Always keep on growing, all the time. Um, and that, you know, it also explains why I'm um, pretty happy to be part um, of the mission of uh, Engineers of Tomorrow um, in Canada, for which I'm uh, a collaborator, also a speaker. Um, it really uh, assists in nourishing young minds, in becoming the future problem solvers of our, of, of the world, literally, that's literally what it is. That, and you know, you don't need to have the title of, a, of an engineer to be a problem solver. Every day, everyone faces challenges that requires to find a solution. Every day, you drive your car, and you have a path in your mind. Street is close. What do you do? You use, you wait. No, you gotta find a solution, right? Working with this knowledge or this understanding, apply this to everything around you in the world, right? And everyone is an engineer in some point, but there are different levels of engineering. That's why the title does exist, because you have advanced degrees and advanced knowledge with science and so on to bring kind of uh, the, the bigger ideas in, in physically available for everyone. Um, but understanding the problem solving piece of starts within and what starts within allows to also make that transition uh, from a negative emotion to a positive emotion and when how great do we feel with ourselves when we think that we hit a problem and we found a solution we feel lighter yes because the, the what we think is a problem is is the weight on our shoulders now imagine if the young ones are learning this at a very early age. Their growth is more positive and they, they're more relaxed and, and truly in, in confidence with what they will reach in the future or throughout the path. There's gonna there be some fails. Uh, and that's what's great with the engineers of, of tomorrow or, or whatever I do with them is because they work as a team, they become problem solvers together. So it does bring that collaboration together and be open-minded to other potential solutions. And throughout Earth Timeline, there has been several solutions to a single problem. The key, simple solution, we want to have a door locked. How many different keys exist out there? Oh, tons. The wheel, simple thing whatever rolls, right? Uh, the light bulb, we need to see something. We need to illuminate our lives. Well, there's lots of light bulbs. Everyone engineered a light bulb, but there's different forms to it. It's the same, same final result, right? But it's different shape. So uh, this diversity of ideas teach to the young ones, brings a lot of open mindedness to different alternative diversity of thoughts, collaboration, and if their starting point is pointing a ananas, saying ananas, ananas, um, well, that's right there, there's the start of something. Let me explain to you what you can do with this ananas, right? And, and as they grow, you can start to tie in additional, maybe, uh, um, way to face a problem with their thoughts. 
using the theory that is shared in the books. So, uh, so when someone, sh when I hear young ones say ananas, well, something is already in the mind, right? And it's just a figure of speech, right? Obviously, I bring this maybe to a bigger picture, uh, but it's just a way to see it. But uh, the young ones, uh, they need to be positively fed so they can grow to become the change that this world needs.